Hello, Jared Gucci here, Mr. Internet Tips. Today I'm gonna to show you how to create a custom thumbnail so when somebody is on your website and they wanna share a blog post or some of your content on Facebook, you can actually designate a certain image that will show up when they share that content. And just to sh show you how it works, if somebody's on your website, they click on your Facebook share button, you get a little dialog window that pops up, it's the title of the content, little description, and then you will have a choice of a few thumbnails. Depending on the pictures that are on that page, you may have a selection. But I'm going to show you how to actually dictate what picture shows up there so it can be the same for all of your posts. Okay, so it's actually real simple. The first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to create your custom image. And you can create it in any photo editing software that you have. The dimensions need to be 90 pixels wide by 69 pixels high. And once you have that created, you're going to go into your WordPress media uploader and you're going to upload the file to your WordPress. So we just upload the file there. And down here is the file URL. This is the actual address to that image. We're gonna to wanna to copy that. And then we're gonna to wanna to go into our WordPress editor and we wanna look for the header PHP file. We click on that and then we want to look for a bit of code that has WP underscore head in it. And directly beneath that, we want to paste this in there. And don't worry, I do have this information in the description below this video. So you can actually get that bit of code. And this is where you would put the address to that file. Okay, and you would update the file. And now when somebody is on your website and they want to share something on Facebook, it's always going to be that image. They're not going to have a selection. And if we look at another blog post and we click Facebook share, same image. Okay, and just another real quick tip is when this dialogue pops up, you can actually change the title and you can also change the description while you're there as well. So I hope this was helpful, but it's a really neat way if you wanna just make sure that your branding is on every post and every bit of content that people share on Facebook, this is the way to do it. If you have any questions, comment on the video, and thank you for watching.